are here at Spud Crab Company. Spud Point Crab Company. Spud Point Crab Company. Uh, We're in Bodega Bay, California, which yep. is about an hour and a half north of San Francisco, straight up the coast. Yep. And it's straight. There's more coast. Coast. Yep. Uh, so we actually took the highway one up, which was a beautiful drive. It was. We stopped at a couple points. I mean, it was. We spent what several hours now, probably. Yeah. It's, it's half, a half a day. Spent half day. Yeah. Yep. Uh, beautiful weather too, so we're very fortunate. Yeah. Uh, so uh, this place has been rated the best uh, chowder in the state several times, yeah. and uh, so we had to make the drive up to see. Uh, so we're gonna try this and see how mm -hmm. it compares to the others that we've been having. So we did ask a local, um, someone working in a gift shop who mentioned that they're very award-winning. I don't know which awards they've won, but I believe it um, from what little I've seen right, already. Um, we went to place our order and the woman asked us if we wanted to sample, so we did. Um, we accept, neither one of us has had the Manhattan clam chowder, which is a tomato-based, and it is delicious, but we like the, the traditional um, New England butter, so we went with that. Yep. But it, I love that we were able to try that, and it was very good. Yes, it, it is definitely worth getting if you if you like it it is super good yeah. just the other one is oh even my better gosh, it was so good now with with your order of which a bowl of clam chowder is only eight dollars seven ninety five so it gets a little bit of a milk film on it's top nice and warm and lots of chunks of both clam and potato you can see lots of seasoning in there you can see all that butter in there oh my gosh First full size bite. Oh my gosh. That I'm fairly new to clam chowder. I've never eaten it very much. But I've had it several times in the last week that I've been out here. This is the best I've had yet, that's for sure. That is so good. Everything is so tender. Yep, even though we came here just an hour before close, all of the seafood is cooked perfectly. None of it is wobbly. Uh, mm -hmm. I uh, took a couple of bites to make sure it just tastes really good the flavoring is spot on you can tell it's homemade uh, and it doesn't have that jelly type uh, cream to it mm -hmm. like it fresh is cream, yeah fresh butter, fresh yeah it's almost more of a soup than a chowder um, it's, it's, it's still definitely a chowder I think but yeah. it's not as thick or sticky as some chowders we've had yeah, yeah. So on top of that, uh, they recommended that we try the... The crab sandwich. We have four seafood sandwiches, crab, seafood, shrimp, and albacore tuna. The yep. crab being the most expensive, $15.95. Yeah, everything is super well-placed here. So. How much crab meat is in that thing? Wow. That's a lot of crab meat. I'm guessing this is oh. a sourdough roll. Yeah, that is super. It's so simplistic, but it's so good. Oh my god! Honestly, like so much crab meat, just enough of the dressing to kind of make it stick together and give it just a little bit um, of additional flavor. But that crab meat is so tender and sweet and chewy. It's 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 not that over minced stuff. It's nice and thick chunks. Mm. Oh, yep. and they, uh, they toast the roll. You can see they actually toast the roll before they put the crab meat on it. That yep. is something amazing. Yep. And then we went a step further because they have these giant loaves. And we didn't even know how giant it was when we ordered yeah, it. We it was, thought, oh, we're getting two things of soup. Let's get And some what was that? Uh, sourdough bread. It was three ninety five. dollars Yeah. This giant thing of it. Yep. And then she threw in 14 of these little things to go with it, of the butters. I personally really like a sourdough that has got quite a bit of a... Of the sour? Yeah. That little, that tangy flavor. No, they list it as French bread, but we asked her and she said it's a sourdough. It's a very mild sourdough. Yep, it's still quite good. It is super soft. Mm -hmm. uh, and this would be a great bread to take on the road with you to mm -hmm. just nibble on here and there, or make a sandwich. Good yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing next to you. Mm -hmm. this New England chowder is so good. And it's so hot. Mm hmm. So, they do not have seating uh, inside here. It's just a There's couple of tables. You order from the, the window, yeah. So, if you're ever able to make a trip up, trip up north of San Francisco, this is totally worth checking out. 
Yeah, it, it really is worth the drive. Even the drive itself is worth the drive. So yeah. definitely yeah. it's worth it taking a day away from your visit to San Francisco to uh, make this drive. And to eat here at Spud Point Craft Company. Yep. So if you guys found this helpful, please like and subscribe because it really helps us keep motivated bringing you more content. So thanks for talking about